let's continue. And uh, I noticed something that this time I'm getting answer to dots and sometimes I don't get the answer to dots. So that's a problem because I don't want this answer to dots. It's not really necessary for me. So I will say, I will say, please return me only the JSON object. Let's see if it, if it understands what I mean and doesn't return me the answer to dots because answer to dots, it's a, it's a, it's the object inside the property and that's not, not what I want. Yes, now it's correct. I'll test it again. I'll do again the three times, three times the same. If I get the three times the same result, Fiscal code concept Jesus Christ subtotal. I'm again getting different data. Look, subtotal here it's under um oh Jesus Christ. You see what I mean? The it's not uh, uh it's not um, my use. That's another problem. Okay, we will see how to fix that. We will see how to fix that. To now, I'm, I'm, now I want to make sure that the answer is not inside. Okay, um, the third time. Okay, um, how do I specify that they want the? I want the. Hmm. I want the concept as concept. Now it's okay, but before it was, before it was in uh, my use. I don't know why it took the decision as concept. Uh, <laughs> please respect the. How do you say this? In, please make yeah make it uh, how do you say my use no in English one one moment uh, lowercase please yeah always lowercase yeah I'll, I'll add this okay to every and I will put it inside a bigger block always lowercase now make the Total always lowercase. Okay. I don't think I need the lowercase, but I'll I'll try it like this. Mm-hmm. Fiscal code. Yeah, I'll make everything lowercase, even this, to have always the same format, right? To have always absolutely the, the same. So I will I deleted the my use in the C. Yeah, taxes. Always lowercase, and this inside a pa another parenthesis. And uh, parenthesis here. Okay, and uh, let's test it in format. This is not really; it doesn't matter because it's not numbers cannot be lower or uppercase, of course. I mean, string numbers. Okay, first try. It's all in lowercase. Good. Second time. Second time it's lowercase, 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 lowercase. Good. Third time it's third time it's uh, lowercase, lowercase, lowercase. Yeah, lowercase. Okay. There is a science. Eh? There is a science here. I'm not. 
Uh, no, as I told you, there is, they say there are a lot of jobs. There are the new jobs to be a prompt engineer. You saw there is some technique. It's not as simple as you get the, the answers. They change. You need to be very specific. And even I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not 100% sure that this will always get the same result. So, but um, you saw, you saw with this case that you need to be specific, specify, like um, make lists because I, 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 I've, I've read that what happens behind is that this is converted into programming language. So these are probably classes or uh, properties. So the more specific you are and, and the program understands correctly, the better. Well, we will leave it like this. Great. And um, now we need to get the, uh, I will get the data. So I need a JavaScript. I need to still clean more the data. Okay. So what I need to do, remember here, we run once for each item. And now I'm getting a string. This is a string. Okay. And I need to convert it into a javascript object so i will create a new property called invoice right and here is where i will uh, create I, I make it a javascript a plain javascript object and um, here i get the text the json text the json text it's equal to dollar input dot item.json.text okay so i'm getting this text and um, that will be the string and there is a property in javascript called i will call it uh, javascript object which is json parse okay that receives a text and converts it to a javascript object json string i will call it better I will show you now. I will show you now uh, what I received first. Okay, console.log the string received JSON string, and then what this method it's doing. You will see the difference. Console.log object. Yeah, it's not the same data format. JavaScript object. JavaScript object, and now here. I will um, convert invoice. I will put my own properties, which um, which are going to see. Well, it's not really necessary. I think. I think uh, if I do it like this, JavaScript object should be enough. Uh, console log this. I think this should work. Let's do it. Let's test it. Remember, three dots, more tools, tools for developers, console, and we clean and we clean this up. Okay, so I'll execute it. And this is a string and this is a JavaScript object. Okay, you see this makes me that I can get every um, I can get all the properties. Google Cloud. You see the concept has changed. You see it's not deterministic. This fiscal code, but the real important data is the subtotal, tax, to, taxes, and total. Uh, yeah, I think I don't need to. I don't need like this. It will work. Yeah. Okay. 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 So now the data will be inside the the property of uh, invoice. Okay. Great. Final step: Google Sheets. Okay. If you remember. Well, we will leave this for the, for the last video.